has evolved as well. One example of how we have evolved has been our effort to enable... Uh, these are absolutely tragic and heartbreaking situations, and our hearts go out to the people of Mosul and of Iraq and other places where we are operating. We acknowledge our responsibility to operate at a higher standard. It is my responsibility as a combatant commander to ensure that our forces operate in accordance with those goals and, and standards. And there is still much to learn from this. We have a general officer assigned. We take every allegation seriously, and we are executing a what we, are, we have and are executing a well-developed process to assess and, if necessary, investigate each of these allegations. How we do things is as important as the things we actually do. And we are doing everything humanly possible to prevent these types of events and incidents from occurring as a result of our operations. United States Central Command, and particularly to our forces located forward in the And while we consider and establish accountability over our actions in this incident, I think it is also important to clearly recognize that the enemy does use uh, human shields, has little regard for human life, and does attempt to use civilian casualty allegations as a tool to hinder our operations. And so they bear responsibility for this as well. And the implication is now we are carelessly dropping bombs. And we have not relaxed the rules of engagement. I have authorized Lieutenant General Townsend to delegate the employment of rules of engagement to the appropriate level due to the tough urban fight uh, that we knew was coming in Mosul. To be clear, there were no changes uh, it's going to, uh, next month or so, it's going to... I think, uh, think we've pretty well established. We, we, are, at a, we are at a stalemate right now. Uh, right now, I would say that it, it is in generally in favor of the, of the government uh, of, of Afghanistan, but stalemates have a tendency to, the, to decline over time. So I think we do have to, uh, we have to continue to support this. We have two missions in, 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 uh, in Afghanistan. One is our counterterrorism mission, fully resourced. That is going pretty well. Uh, I feel very confident in that. The other one is the NATO mission, the train, advise, and assist. Uh, and that is one where I think we, we ought to consider uh, looking at our objectives here and how we, how we continue to support that mission uh, going forward. Hey, Mr. Chairman, General, thank you so much for your service. I want to turn to Afghanistan. Uh, 